Nouvelle on screen. So let's watch Thierry Nouvelle then, who has been so, so very good all afternoon. But so too is this man, Tony Cairoli. Cairoli in the triple two car. Oh, he clips the barrier, Dave. He's clipped the barrier. So here's Thierry Nouvelle then, who has nailed every single one of these. Thierry Nouvelle has not made an error, and he doesn't on that occasion either. Pinpoint accuracy is what he's had throughout the course of the heat and the semi-finals, and now he's in the final. Look at the flames out of the back of the exhaust in that I-20 Hyundai. This is a three-lap final, remember. You're watching Thierry Nouvelle on screen. Three weeks ago, he put a Hyundai on its roof in Wales in the Rally of GB. He's back here at Monza. He's in the final, and I think he's got a very slight lead over I Tony K. Rowley. There is the Sicilian on screen right now. Oh, he pushes a tyre barrier out the way. No harm done. So Cairoli will know that he, uh, Nouvelle looks like he's got just a little bit of a margin over him and therefore he's going to be even more aggressive and even more determined and he goes just a little bit wide there but that's the first time we've seen Tony Cairoli do that. A little bit of an error there and uh, well Thierry Nouvelle has just been pinpoint accurate with everything. So here is uh, Tony Cairoli then, we'll get the first lap. Uh, conclusion in just a couple of moments and we'll see the uh, margin between the two of them. We're watching Tony Cairoli at the moment as they head towards the timing line now. Cairoli's he's got a, it. He's Cairoli's got it. By 0.7 of a second over this man on screen, the 27 year old Belgian Thierry Nouvelle has got to make up almost one second in the Hyundai i20. What that does do, it proves to us that one part of the circuit is appearing to be quicker than the other now. Because when we look at them over the timing line, it's proof as Thierry Nouvelle now oh, does he everything he can to try and come back. He's got damage. He does. He's pushed the 958 Centurio barrier out the way. He has got damage to the front of that Hyundai. Let's see if it costs him. Is it just superficial? Is it, is it mechanical? He's still going at it like there's no tomorrow. This is the final. So I think, unseen by us, Thierry Gary Nouvelle probably made an error somewhere and that's what's caused that panel damage. Across the line goes Tony K. Rowley, the final of the Monster Energy Monza Rally Show. In the darkness, it is barely above freezing temperature here at Monza, but the crowd are absolutely glued to their seats. Tony K. Rowley sideways. The triple two car approaches the Santero chicane. And goes very wide once he does. again. But He's then gone wide. Track temperature has plummeted and Tony Cairoli doing everything he can to try and maintain some uh, traction through this part, this chicane as he heads up now towards uh, the uh, double hairpin section, loses that speed, scrubs it off, the car is thrown sideways. Oh, he's taken a barrier out. He has taken a barrier out. This is the end of lap number two. They're oh, on their final lap. Just K. five Rowley. tenths. K. Rowley, there's nothing in it. Half a second, the final of the Monster Energy Monza Rally Show. Tony K. Rowley, the Sicilian, he's touched the wall. He has touched the pit lane wall in at that Citroën. Let's see if there's damage this time round. The flames are pelting out the exhaust in the nighttime air here at Monza. Watch the brakes almost glowing red hot. We can almost see it. But he was a little bit cautious on the brakes that time going into the Pirelli hairpin. Fires up those Pirelli tyres. Put the power down. This is the F1 pit lane entry. Tony K. Rowley, the final. Oh, a little bit sideways. This is the pit lane entry. Nouvelle, he has got damage severely to the front of that Hyundai i20. They come across the line. We've got half a lap to go. Well, Nouvelle under the timing line at that point, under that uh, monster banner, you would have said that Nouvelle was ahead, but actually in reality, there's nothing in it. Whatever panel damage Thierry Nouvelle has got to that car, it's not affecting the handling. It's not affecting the pace or the power that he's got as we go back to Tony Cairoli for the final time around that 95.8 Santero Tower. Look at the damage at the front of the Hyundai for Thierry Nouvelle, the final stages of the 2015 Monster Energy Monster Rally Show. Smoke pouring off the bodywork, smoke pouring off the tyres. The chequered flag is being ready, I think, in a few moments' time. The crowd are absolutely going ape here at Monza. Tony K. Rowley across the line has won the 2015 Monster Energy Monza Rally Show. 
Wow, what a race, what a final. This man on screen, the 30-year-old Sicilian, the eight-time motocross world champion, has just taken out the Monster Rally Show. Dave Richardson, unbelievable He's here at Monza. He with some phenomenal donuts. A 1.4 second margin is what's seen him take the victory here at Monza.